Okay, welcome to the guitar show. This is just a really short, simple video. I'm going to be talking about shall I use a plectrum or shall I use my fingers? You know, which one should I use? You know, um, my opinion is you should do both. Okay, it's really good to use your fingers and a plectrum and a fingers and plectrum. Okay, so let's just have a look at why we should do both. Right, when you're using your fingers, for example. beautiful sound, it's more delicate, you can get much more dynamics. Also you can do rhythms. You know, because you can use double stops and fragments like that. So when you're playing with a plectrum however, it's, you can still do all of that. You can still get dynamics. But you, I think you have less of a dynamic range really between your fingers and your plectrums. Also, when you're... To use both, you know, if you can use your, your plectrum and your fingers as well. See this, but I'm kind of let me come a bit closer. So there, I'm kind of. So another really cool thing is to use um, fingers and plectrum for chords. So that's, you know, that's a few different reasons um, why you should be able to do both. Um, sometimes it's really cool if you can play, say for example you play something with your fingers. And then trying to do the same with your, your plectrum and your fingers. a little bit more but you can kind of see whereas with the fingers it kind of rolls off a little bit easier so that's why I kind of it's really nice to develop um, a facility to do both um, a really great player to check out is Martin Offler and we're going to be doing some videos on him He's got that kind of um, you know, so okay. Another thing is playing guitar like a classical guitar, you know, obviously. kind of style of playing you're really you know you classical guitar technique with your thumb kind of on the lower strings and then your first second third here on the higher strings and that's a, a really nice sort of way of playing you know, obviously stay away to heaven but you can bring it into your soloing you know almost like you know my twin brother He's a bass player and he, he's, his kind of technique is with the two fingers. You know, so there's an, a few different ways you can, you can use your fingers um, as opposed to um, with a plectrum. Another, another kind of way is if you're strumming, you know, you might want to strum like this. I'm not actually, I'm not kind of just using my first finger and going. But you could do, you could use your thumb, you can use your thumb and your first finger to, thumb to, and your, your finger to go up. But what I 
I tend to do is to like to use these two fingers together, these kind of work in tandem, and then my first finger and then my thumb. So you're kind of using a combination. <laughs> appropriate then to use a plectrum key. You know, so that's just, just a few little ideas um, hopefully I can give to you. If you want me to go more in depth into some finger style techniques and some more plectrum uh, techniques um, I can do so but until then have a great time and see you guys on the road. Bye.